I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on fractions. We will learn the concept of addition and subtraction of fractions in this video. Here is a very good example. Anya and Tanya are sharing a watermelon. Anya ate 5 twelfth of the watermelon and Tanya ate 1 sixth of watermelon. What fraction of watermelon was left? So that's the question for you. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now we'll solve this question in different ways, right? So let's say, uh, first, we'll adopt method one. So this is our method one. Method one is that we'll sketch. So let's say this is the whole watermelon. Okay. Now, since we are talking about 5 twelfth, that means I should be dividing this into 12 equal parts, right? So let's try to divide this into 12 equal parts. So, so we get 4. Now, each 4 we will divide into 3 parts, so we get 12, right? So we'll so think these are all equal, right? In fractions, we are normally talking about equal parts. It's very difficult to draw like that, but we'll assume that all are equal. See, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 equal parts, right? So what we have here, we have 12 equal parts. This is important. Otherwise, it is not a fraction. Okay. Now, we are saying that Anya ate 5 twelfth. That means out of this, 5 of them. So, so 8, so we'll say 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So these 5 will shade for Anya. Right? So, okay. So we want to shade all of them. Five twelfths. So this is goes for Anya. A eight five out of twelve. Now let's talk about Tanya. Now we see Tanya ate one sixth. Now what is one sixth equal to? We have one twelfth. So what we will do here is we'll multiply by 2. So we'll 2 over 12. So she ate 2 out of 12. You understand? So 2 out of 12 means these two. Let us see. So this for us is 1 sixth or 2 out of 12. Correct? Both are same. This is for Tanya. Now the question is, what fraction of watermelon was left? Well, now you can count, right? You have 1 twelfth, 2 twelfth, 3 twelfth, 4 twelfth, 5 twelfth. So you have 5 out of 12 left. Is that clear to you? So, sketching makes it very simple. Now let us see how to do the same question using algebra right that is operations addition and subtraction operations so method two so whenever we say they ate that much that means Anya ate five out of twelve and Tanya ate one out of six they ate that much from one whole right one whole means one whole right Left means you have to take away what they ate. So that much is left. Is that clear? So from the whole, we take away what they ate. 5 out of 12 and 6 out of 12. It is important to make this bracket to indicate that this total has been taken away, right? Not just the first one, both. Okay. Now, 
we have to make them as common denominators. This is very important. So whenever you work with fractions, you can add or subtract only with having common denominators. Which is like 1 12th. Do you see this 1 12th? Each is 1 12th. So 12 pieces, equal pieces. That is your denominator. So our common denominator is 12. We'll say lowest common denominator is 12. So we have to write each number with denominator of 12. So 1 could be written as 12 over 12. Do you see that? 12 over 12 is 1 minus. Now within this bracket, which was eaten, right? So 5 out of 12 already written with common denominator 12. For 1 sixth as we did here. We'll write this as 2 out of 12. Does it make sense to you? So that means we have 12 out of 12 take away. When you add them, you get 7. 7 out of 12. Now you can take away from 12, 7. And what do you get? 5 out of 12. Do you see that part? So that becomes our answer. So do you see answer matches? Both are same, correct? So, whichever method you use, you get the same answer. Perfect. It is not very easy to draw always. So, you need to adopt method 2 most of the time. Perfect. If the question is simpler, where you can draw, that is a good strategy. So, I hope you understand and appreciate the strategy. When to use which one. And when we are saying 8, so combine them and then take away from the whole you get the idea if you do one by one it is incorrect okay so you have to take away both of them from one so i hope that helps feel free to write your comment share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for watching and all the best